Morning, Adrian at Engine Carbon Clean. We're here in Warsaw this morning. We've got a Ford Cougar 2009, two litre diesel. Now this one has had a couple of DPF codes uh, appearing on and off over the uh, last few months. Um, we've come and had a look at it this morning. All the live data appears to be fine on everything apart from the uh, coolant temperature. So uh, there's a single code in there just basically saying the uh, particulate trap efficiency was below threshold. Uh, back pressure on the DPF doesn't look that bad. Uh, it's 350 odd uh, miles since it lasted a DPF regen. Um, the last time it did, it only did it for about two miles. Now the owner's doing short journeys. Uh, what we've found with it, so we're just taking it out for a drive, code free. Uh, it's still code free, we come back, it's not even attempted to regenerate, even though there's enough fuel in it. Uh, and the coolant temperature's hovered around 78 to 80 at best, even with all the fans off inside. Um, that says to me that the uh, thermostat's starting to stick open and explains why in the cold weather uh, it started to have issues. So get it into the summer, it probably wouldn't have a problem with regenerating, but get it into winter, it's going to be too cold, uh, it's not going to regenerate. So, plan of attack for this one, no cleaning today. Uh, go and get a new, um, a new thermostat on this one, and then take it for a drive, hopefully it'll regenerate at that point. But yeah, key thing to keep in mind, if you're struggling with DPF issues, make sure there's more than a quarter of a tank of fuel in it. Uh, and if your coolant temperature looks low, if you can check it, uh, sorry BMW owners, I know you can't on the older ones, um, then you want to get that uh, thermostat sorted out. So yeah, hopefully this one, new thermostat, and then it'll uh, start to regenerate again.